about getting out, getting out of your comfort zone, getting out of your box, getting out of your mind a little bit, changing your mindset, but really getting active within your community, within your environment. We work on trying to enable individuals with their mindset and with empowerment. And Flatwater is all about that. We coach through Get Out Girl in a positive way to enable people. And Flatwater coaches and counsels individuals through that cancer journey. And it's a perfect match. The Paddle Jam is about a sense of peace. You're going outside your box. And the energy is just incredible. Paddle Jam is a pretty amazing thing. It was a vision that Cindy had to bring women together and really just empower one another, get on the water, have a tranquil place um, to just kind of get out and get active together. It was amazing. People walk out of here, they've been on a paddle board two times, they've never paddled a mile, and all of a sudden they paddle eight. They got out there with these women who encouraged them to keep going and believed in them, and, and now they walk away knowing that they're capable if they put their mind to something probably do far more than what they believe they could do on their own. This event means to me the connection with Kristen, my wife. Um, she was very passionate about it as well as I was for providing care to people that need counseling for cancer. And the Flatwater Foundation provides that. Kristen taught me to not stay within the parameters of what society tells me to, right? and that I need to stretch my boundaries, and that's what it means to me. Um, it's about the support of the community. Kristen McLean was a star flight nurse. She was a flight nurse here in Austin, Texas. She was killed April 27, 2015 in a hoist rescue over the Greenbelt. She was a big part of the Austin community. She was a big part of the Colorado Summit County community. She flew there. And that's what she did. She was, she was a get-out girl. She inspired people. She helped them get out of their box. She helped them conquer fears. She helped them feel better. She also was all about the lake. She loved surfing. She loved the water. She loved paddling. So again, it's those two elements combined. You can train them for the physical part, but that mental part is, is really where that coaching and that element happens. That's the difference of, of making it and finishing, right? And it's the same thing with a cancer journey, or the same thing with a first responder who's had an awful night or who's had a, a tragic incident. It's that mental capacity to help enable them.